Here at Overdy Vest Nurseries we grow a very wide selection of different types of hydrangeas and I think we're very fortunate in that we have some of the world's top plant breeders sending us new varieties for us to test and trial all the time. We're looking for varieties that perform particularly well here in our region, the mid-Atlantic and northeastern states of the USA. And this lovely variety here that in front of us that is called hydrangea wedding gown is one that's reached us all the way from Japan. Now in our trials and testing here on the nursery, I have to tell you that it has been performing remarkably well. We're really very fond of it. It's a variety that gets about three foot high and spreads out to make a mound that's wider rather than tall. If you've got a plant that's about three foot, you can expect this one to spread out to about four or five foot. And as you see now in summertime, it's producing lots and lots of buds. They start out first with these tight green little buds that then gradually as they develop you'll see that they start to turn into more of a lace cap type flower that has this flat inflorescence and around the extremities of the flower you'll see that it's covered with lots of these little double florets that go around the whole part of the flower head. But then look into the middle of the flower and you'll see that it's got lots of other little flowers too that are starting to develop. And what's interesting about this one that as they grow, they grow into a more rounded shape and so that at times you'll have flowers on here that look more like a mop head than a lace cap. Of course, what we're looking for in the garden is good, reliable performers. And we found in our trials that this is a really good, strong growing, hardy variety that flowers on both new wood and older wood. Now, like other hydrangeas, it's important that you plant them in free draining soil. But it's also a good idea when you plant it that you incorporate plenty of organic matter too. That's planting compost. Mix, mix that in, in the base of the hole, and also with the backfilled soil, and you'll find that they'll root into that, and that's the stuff that's going to keep long, young, strong growth coming, that's going to give you a succession of rebloom through the rest of the summer. So all in all, this is an excellent performer that gives you lots of these gorgeous, pristine, white flowers that look absolutely gorgeous whether you plant it as a single individual or better still if you've got the space this is something that you might like to put in in larger groups ideally if you could plant it in a place that's got protection from the hot afternoon sun so if you could find somewhere that's got some dapple shade, perhaps a partially shaded site that gets the morning sun, but the hot afternoon sun of the afternoon is protected from that, then you'll find that you'll have a plant that gives you lots of flowers, but also lasts much longer in its flowering. So all in all, an excellent performer, a hardy, reliable variety that I think you'll find does very well. This is Hydrangea Wedding Gun.